Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into the exciting updates coming with iOS 18 and iPadOS 18. Apple has packed in some fantastic new features that will revolutionize your device experience. Let's break down what's in store. First up, iOS 18 is bringing support for Rich Communication Service, or RCS, to the Messages app. This means end-to-end -end encryption, better media sharing, and proper group chats. You'll also be able to tap back with emojis and stickers, format text with effects, and even send messages via satellite. Home screen and control center customization. iPhone users, get ready for more control over your home screens. In iOS 18, you can freely move app icons, change their colors, and use a tint color picker. Plus, Control Center will offer more customization options, allowing you to program quick controls from third-party apps. This brings iOS closer to the flexibility Android users enjoy. Photos app redesign. The Photos app is getting a major redesign. It will now intelligently organize your photos around memories, trips, and events. Say goodbye to the old tabbed layout and hello to a sleek one-page design where you can view photos individually or by collections. Plus, you can filter out screenshots and receipts to keep your photo groups neat. Privacy features. Privacy gets a boost with iOS 18. You'll be able to lock apps behind Face ID or Touch ID, ensuring sensitive information stays secure. Additionally, you can hide apps in a special folder, keeping them out of sight from prying eyes. Calculator app overhaul. The Calculator app is getting a big upgrade, featuring improved unit conversions, a sidebar with recent activity, and integration with the Notes app. And guess what? For the first time, the Calculator app is coming to iPads with iPad OS 18. It includes a new feature called Math Notes, letting you write out equations with the Apple Pencil and solve them instantly. iPad OS 18 new features. iPad OS 18 also introduces a new tab bar, similar to the Dynamic Island on iPhones. This bar makes it easier to access controls while in apps, appearing at the top or as a sidebar. The Notes app is getting Smart Script, which will make your handwriting more legible automatically. Maco Sequoia. Let's talk about Maco Sequoia, the next iteration of Apple's computer software. One of the standout features is iPhone mirroring, which lets you see and control your iPhone screen directly on your Mac. Imagine using your Mac's keyboard and trackpad to interact with your iPhone apps without even picking up your phone. A brand new passwords app builds on iCloud Keychain saving all your passwords and login credentials across devices. It also handles passkeys, verification codes, and lets you securely share passwords with others. This app will also be available on Windows. Other updates include a Snap Window Arrangement tool for better multitasking, presenter preview, to see what you're about to share in calls, and gaming upgrades with Game Porting Toolkit dues for improved Windows game porting. Plus, the new Image Playground feature in Apple Intelligence allows you to create AI-generated images in various styles. Now let's move on to watchOS once. This update brings two major features, Training Load and a new Vitals app. Training Load analyzes your workout data to estimate effort levels, giving each session a rating from you know, easy, to D's, all out. It helps you understand how hard you've worked in each workout. The Vitals app will show how your captured health data like heart rate, compares to your baseline. This helps you identify when something might be off and outside the normal range. The Activity app on iPhone is also getting an update to accompany watchOS once. You'll be able to customize the home page to display the most important stats front and center. Cycle tracking is getting an update too, with detailed pregnancy insights, gestational age, and related health metrics. Vision OS 2. Apple's Vision Pro headset, previously available only in the United States, will soon be rolling out to additional countries including Australia, Canada, China, France, Germany, Japan, Singapore, and the United Kingdom. With Vision OS dues, Apple is introducing spatial photos, adding depth to images in the Photos app. New UI gesture controls will make navigation more intuitive, and improved Mac screen mirroring will support higher resolutions and larger display sizes. AirPods Pro audio updates. Apple is enhancing voice isolation, making it easier for your AirPods to pick up your voice even in noisy environments. A fantastic new feature is the silent head nod interaction. Simply nod your head to answer a call or shake your head to decline it without having to say a word to Siri. This feature will also work for messages and notifications, making interactions seamless and silent. Now these updates are rolling out soon and we can't wait for you to try them. What are you most excited about? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more updates on all things Apple. 
See you next time.